have you ever wondered about the top 10 hotspots to visit in France? Ah, uh, France. A country that effortlessly blends timeless beauty with a rich tapestry of history, culture, and gastronomy. A land where cobblestone streets echo tales of the past and where every village, every city, holds a unique charm. In this video, we're about to embark on a journey that will take us from the lofty peaks of the French Alps to the sun-kissed shores of the French Riviera. We'll wander through the grandeur of Versailles, the gothic splendor of Saint-Chapelle, and the iconic silhouette of the Eiffel Tower, just to name a few. And here's the twist. We're going to be counting down. Yes, from the 10th hotspot to the first, we'll be exploring what makes each of these destinations a must-visit on any French itinerary. So, fasten your seatbelts. Or shall we say, boucle votre ceinture. Stay tuned as we start the countdown from the 10th hotspot all the way to the first. Starting at number 10, we find ourselves in the grandeur of the Palace of Versailles. This opulent chateau, situated in the Ile de France region, was the seat of political power in the Kingdom of France from 1682 until 1789. An epicenter of absolute monarchy, Versailles has seen the unfolding of significant historical events, including the signing of the Treaty of Versailles, which marked the end of World War I. The palace's architectural brilliance is an ode to French Baroque style, from the gilded facade to the intricate interiors, each room narrates its own unique tale. The Hall of Mirrors, for instance, with its 357 mirrors, is a testament to the artistic grandeur of 17th century France. Beyond the palace walls, the gardens of Versailles sprawl over 800 hectares. These meticulously manicured gardens, adorned with elegant fountains, classical statues and ornate flowerbeds are a sight to behold. The grandeur of the palace extends to the Grand Canal, a perfect spot for a leisurely stroll or a romantic boat ride. Versailles is not just a palace, it's a treasure trove of French history, art, and culture. The lavishness of its architecture, coupled with its rich past, makes it an unforgettable destination. A royal spectacle that truly captures the essence of French history and architecture. At number 9, we have the awe-inspiring Saint-Chapelle. Tucked away in the heart of Paris, this Gothic gem is a marvel of medieval architecture. Built in the 13th century, Saint-Chapelle was originally intended to house precious Christian relics. Today, it stands as a testament to the exquisite craftsmanship of its time. The chapel's breathtaking stained glass windows are its crowning glory, with over a thousand intricate designs depicting biblical scenes in vibrant hues. Each panel is a story waiting to be told a masterpiece of light and color that transforms the chapel into a kaleidoscope of divine inspiration. But it's not just the glasswork that's impressive. The stonework, the towering spires, the delicate carvings, all bear the mark of artisans who labored with devotion and skill. The chapel's ethereal beauty, its almost otherworldly aura, draws you in and holds you in awe. Saint Chapelle is more than just a chapel. It's a journey into a time when faith was expressed through art, when every stone, every glass shard told a story. A true testament to the intricate craftsmanship of the Middle Ages. Coming in at number 8 are the historical D-Day beaches of Normandy. These beaches bear silent witness to one of the most pivotal moments in history, the D-Day landings during the Second World War. Over 70 years ago, thousands of brave soldiers stormed these very sands, forever etching June 6, 1944 into the annals of history. Each of the five beaches, Utah, Omaha, Gold, Juno, and Sword, holds its own tale of courage, sacrifice, and victory. Dotting the coastline, you'll find numerous war memorials, museums, and preserved bunkers, each providing a sobering glimpse into the past. The American Cemetery at Omaha Beach, for instance, is a sea of white crosses, each representing a life given in the pursuit of freedom. The impact of World War II is still deeply felt here, not only in the preserved historical sites, but also in the hearts of the locals. The people of Normandy continue to honor the memory of those who fought on their shores, ensuring their stories are not forgotten. Visiting these beaches is a humbling experience. Walking along the stretches of sand, you can almost hear the echoes of the past, the shouts of soldiers, the roar of the sea, the silence that followed the storm. It's a place that reminds us of the cost of peace, of the valor of those who fought for it a poignant reminder of the past that shaped our present. At number seven, we explore the picturesque Loire Valley. Nestled in the heart of France, this region is a masterpiece of natural and architectural beauty. The Loire Valley, often referred to as the Garden of France, 
boasts an abundance of vineyards that stretch across its rolling hills, painting a landscape that's as diverse as it is vibrant. The region's vineyards are not just for show, they're the birthplace of some of France's most celebrated wines. From crisp Chenin Blanc to rich Cabernet Franc, each vineyard tells a unique story through its wines, a story that's steeped in tradition and flavored with innovation. But the Loire Valley isn't just about wine, it's also home to some of the most magnificent chateaus in the country. These architectural wonders, each with its own history and charm, dot the landscape, offering a glimpse into the past. From the enchanting Chateau de Chambord with its distinctive French Renaissance architecture to the romantic Chateau de Chenonceau arching over the Cher River, each chateau is a testament to the region's rich heritage. And let's not forget, the Loire Valley is recognized as a UNESCO World Heritage Site. This distinction is a nod to the region's cultural landscape, a harmonious blend of human activity and natural beauty. The Loire Valley is more than just a destination, it's an experience. It's a place where history, nature, and culture intertwine to create a visual feast that's as delicious as the wines it produces. At number six, we encounter the magical Mont Saint-Michel. Perched on a rocky islet in Normandy, this enchanting island commune seems to rise from the sea itself. It's a mystical sight, a vision that almost defies belief. Mont Saint-Michel is known for its unique location, where the rhythm of the tides dramatically transforms the landscape. It's a place where sea and land meet, yet never truly converge. At the heart of this island is the Mont Saint-Michel Abbey, a marvel of medieval architecture. This towering Gothic spire, reaching towards the heavens, is a testament to the grandeur of human ambition and the enduring power of faith. Within its walls, you'll find a labyrinth of cloisters and chapels, each echoing with the whispers of centuries past. Visiting Mont Saint-Michel is an experience like no other. As you wander through its narrow winding streets, you're transported back in time, to an era of knights and nobility. The village itself is a charming maze of quaint shops and traditional houses. And let's not forget the local cuisine, with specialties like the mouth-watering Agno de Presail, lamb that's been grazed on the salty marshland surrounding the island. But perhaps the most magical part of Mont Saint-Michel is the journey to get there. Whether you're walking across the causeway at low tide or taking a shuttle at high tide, you're part of a centuries-old pilgrimage, a journey of discovery that's both physical and spiritual. An enchanting escape that seems straight out of a fairy tale. Halfway through our countdown at number five is the glamorous French Riviera. Take a moment to imagine the epitome of glamour and sophistication, the French Riviera, or as the French call it, the Côte d'Azur. This sun-soaked coastline stretching from Saint-Tropez to the Italian border is a playground for the rich and famous. With its azure blue waters, golden beaches, and luxurious yachts, it's easy to see why this place is a magnet for the world's elite. But the Riviera is not just about glitz and glamour. It's a place that, despite its fame, has managed to retain its Mediterranean charm. The narrow cobbled streets of Nice, the colorful markets of Antibes, the hilltop villages like Ease and St. Paul de Vence all offer a taste of the authentic French lifestyle. Every May, the Riviera takes center stage as the Cannes Film Festival rolls into town. The world's biggest movie stars descend upon the Palais des Festivals, turning the city into a real-life Hollywood set. But even if you're not a movie star, you can still walk the famous La Croisette Promenade, dine at the same restaurants, and enjoy the same stunning views. Whether you're a film fanatic, a sun worshiper, or simply a lover of all things French, the Riviera is a place that has something for everyone. It's more than just a destination. It's a lifestyle, a state of mind a sun-soaked paradise that offers a taste of the high life. At number four, we find the world-renowned Louvre Museum. This illustrious institution nestled in the heart of Paris stands as the largest art museum in the world. Its history is as rich and captivating as the masterpieces it houses. The Louvre started its journey as a fortress in the late 12th century, then transformed into a royal palace in the 16th century, and finally, in 1793, it opened its doors as a public museum. Today, this iconic institution spans a staggering 600,000 square feet and is home to over 35,000 works of art, from antiquities to contemporary pieces. Its collection is a testament to human creativity and ingenuity, dating back to ancient civilizations and spanning all the way to the 21st century. Among the Louvre's vast collection, certain works rise above the rest in fame and recognition. The enigmatic smile of Leonardo da Vinci's Mona Lisa draws millions of visitors each year. Yet she's not alone in her fame. 
the Venus de Milo, an ancient Greek statue known for its missing arms, and the winged victory of Samothrace, a stunning representation of the goddess Nike, are also key highlights of the museum's collection. The Louvre Museum is more than just a building filled with art. It is a cultural cornerstone, a living testament to our shared history and humanity. It is a place where stories of the past come alive and new stories are written every day. It truly is a cultural cornerstone that's home to some of the world's most treasured art. Coming in at number three is the iconic Eiffel Tower. This monumental symbol of Paris needs no introduction. A marvel of 19th century engineering, the Eiffel Tower was built for the 1889 Exposition Universelle. It was an event celebrating the 100th anniversary of the French Revolution, and the tower served as a demonstration of France's industrial prowess to the world. Constructed by Gustave Eiffel and his team, the Iron Lattice Tower was initially met with criticism from some of Paris's leading artists and intellectuals. Yet, it has since become one of the most recognized structures globally. Standing at an impressive 330 meters tall, it was the tallest man-made structure in the world until the completion of the Chrysler Building in New York in 1930. The Eiffel Tower is more than just a symbol of Paris, it's a symbol of France. More than 7 million people ascend the Eiffel Tower each year, making it the most visited paid monument in the world. The tower's three levels offer panoramic views over the city of Paris, and on a clear day you can see as far as 55 kilometers. From the hustle and bustle of the Parisian streets, the Seine River's gentle flow, to the distant view of the Sacre Coeur Basilica, the Eiffel Tower presents the city of light in all its glory, a symbol of love and an architectural marvel that never fails to impress. Just missing out on the top spot at number two are the majestic French Alps. A region that stands as a testament to nature's grandeur, the French Alps are a spectacle to behold. The towering peaks draped in snow, cascading waterfalls and verdant valleys create a breathtaking panorama that's nothing short of a masterpiece. But the allure of the French Alps extends beyond its stunning visuals. It's a paradise for winter sports enthusiasts, offering some of the best skiing opportunities in the world. The slopes here cater to all, from beginners to seasoned professionals. Alpine skiing, snowboarding, cross-country skiing, you name it, the French Alps have it. And then there are the Alpine villages, nestled amid the mountains, exuding an old-world charm that's simply enchanting. Picture quaint chalets with sloping roofs covered in snow, narrow cobblestone streets, and warm, welcoming locals. These villages are the heart and soul of the French Alps, each one with its own unique traditions and customs, offering an immersive cultural experience. But don't be fooled by their rustic charm. These villages are also home to luxurious resorts and world-class restaurants, providing the perfect blend of comfort and adventure. From the adrenaline rush of skiing down a steep slope to the serenity of sipping hot chocolate by a roaring fire, the French Alps offer a range of experiences that cater to every traveler's taste. Indeed, the French Alps are more than just a mountain range. They're a snowy paradise that offers both adventure and tranquility. And finally, at number one, we have the inimitable City of Light, Paris. Drenched in history, dappled with charm and sparkling with a mesmerizing blend of elegance and modernity, Paris is a city that promises an unforgettable journey. From the cobblestone lanes whispering tales of the past to the glimmering lights of its iconic skyline, Paris is a living, breathing testament to the beauty of contrasts. Immerse yourself in the grandeur of the Notre Dame Cathedral, a masterpiece of French Gothic architecture. Step into a world of awe-inspiring stained glass and intricate carvings, where the echoes of the past blend seamlessly with the hum of the present. Every stone, every arch, every gargoyle tells a story, a story of resilience and timelessness. Then, stroll down the world-famous Champs-Élysées, a two-kilometer stretch of sheer elegance. Lined with chic cafes, luxury boutiques, and iconic landmarks, this majestic avenue is the lifeblood of Paris. Feel the pulse of the city as you walk down this grand boulevard, soaking in the vibrant energy and the alluring charm that is quintessentially Parisian. But Paris is more than its landmarks. It's a city that throbs with culture, that breathes art, and that lives to tell tales. It's the birthplace of haute couture, the cradle of world-renowned cuisine, and the canvas of impressionist art. It's a city where poets find their muse, where artists find their inspiration, and where lovers find their romance. Every corner of Paris is a celebration, a celebration of life, of love, of dreams. 
It's a city that invites you to lose yourself in its labyrinth of narrow lanes, to find yourself in its grand museums, and to discover a piece of your heart in its charming cafes. Paris is not just a city, it's an experience, an emotion, a memory waiting to be made. It's a city that has inspired countless stories, sonnets, and songs, and yet, it manages to remain an enigma, a mystery that draws you in time and again. The heart of France, a city that embodies romance, culture, and timeless elegance. And there you have it, the top 10 hotspots to visit in France. A journey that's taken us from the grandeur of Versailles to the tranquil beauty of the Loire Valley, the historical significance of the D-Day beaches of Normandy, to the celestial heights of Mont Saint-Michel. We've basked in the glamour of the French Riviera, marveled at the timeless treasures of the Louvre, and looked out over Paris from the iconic Eiffel Tower. We've breathed in the crisp air of the French Alps and immersed ourselves in the city of light, Paris. Each location, a testament to France's rich history, its diverse landscapes, and its vibrant culture. Each hotspot, a tease of what this beautiful country has to offer. A trip to France is more than just a vacation, it's an immersive experience, a journey of discovery, a love affair with a country that is timeless in its charm. So pack your bags, your adventure in the beautiful country of France awaits.